So we know we can identify a ratio by seeing if it's comparing two quantities that have the same units. Comparing dentist to dentist or graduates to graduates. But which quantity comes first? To answer this question, I like to think to myself, how could I phrase this as A out of B something? And let me explain what I mean. When we had the statement, three out of five dentists recommend toothpaste, the tasty toothpaste, our ratio was three out of five, three over five. In this case, three dentists was my A, and five dentists was my B. Or we could think of it as three was my A, and five was my B. But when we had the statement, out of 500 grads, 200 got jobs in business, well, I could not say 500 out of 200 grads got jobs in business. That's wrong. So I could not write 500 out of 200, or five out of two. However, I could have rephrased this as 200 out of 500 grads got jobs in business, and now 200 is my A, 500 is my B, and my ratio is 200 out of 500, or two out of five. So it looks like once I can phrase something as A out of B, then I can say that the ratio is A over B. Let's do a little bit of practice. So for the following ratios, select which quantity goes in the numerator. Three out of four students are girls. For every 17 cars on the road, two are unregistered. And for every 90 babies, 32 will live to be 100. For each of these three statements, select the appropriate button for the quantity that belongs in the numerator.